OK, well, anyway, I'll go over there. No, go on now, leave a message now. Hi, this is Ron Shepherd. Um, I have to give you a call back. I'm sorry that I missed my appointment this morning. Um, if another appointment can be made for me as soon as possible, thank you. Ron. Finished? Mm. Ron. Yeah. I don't want that coming back to the station, then. Do you not think, yeah. as Alex has said, that if you weren't going to go, you should have cancelled earlier, they could have given someone else that appointment? Yeah, someone else would have been able to use yeah, that appointment, I, I, yeah. I'm sure. I, Cardiology's very serious. Yeah, all right, leave it. I Sorry. appreciate that. I did I did phone them first thing this morning. I did phone them first thing this morning and come in and I said that I might not be able to make it. And they said, OK, fine. Um, that, that oh, was when no you came in here, you said you were definitely going to the hospital. I was supposed to go to the hospital, Alex. I was supposed it, I to suppose, go to the hospital. <coughs> hang on. It's more important no, when no, Ron Ron's comes back fella. because he's got to deal with this before he goes away again. Ron, have your say. Yeah. I phoned the hospital this morning, OK? And they said, if... If you can't make the appointment, that's fine, OK. Uh, we'll make you another one. I did let them know first thing this morning that I might not be able to because... But when you came in I've here, you said you had an appointment well, yeah, at 20 past 12. I did. I was still intending on going. They said, if you can't make it, that's fine. OK, I, you know, I haven't But they probably think it. if you can't make it, it's because your pain is too bad, or in this case, if it's... it's uh, I've got a chest infection. Heart. Well, 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 exactly, you know, yeah. yeah. yeah you know, he classed was, his uh, chest when he got through. Hello. Right. It, hello, it's Henry. Oh, sorry, Henry. Uh, yeah. Sorry, I, I didn't hello, have a Henry. chance to say um, English Pete cut in there. Um, uh, Ron, I shouldn't take any notice of English Pete because uh, this was the guy who actually done Andrew Turner down. Yeah, that's uh, true. Uh, Andrew's done a lot for the island. Andrew uh, voiceover he doesn't like. He doesn't like Andrew voiceover. And it seems to be anybody in, a, in any form of, um, you know, who's making something happen on the island, he tends... He, uh, uh, I think what English Pete does, he likes to sit back in his chair and dictate what he thinks every... But he doesn't mm. do anything himself. Well, but, um, to be honest with you, Andrew, I mean, this is one of the reasons as well that I'm moving off the island. I've, I've tried to do my best for the people of the island, you know, and... Um, you know, people have got short memories, and this is why I'm putting my efforts mm. elsewhere into the Philippines. And if I can come to this now before we finish, you know... Hang on, before you do, Jesse's got a question. Well, no, no, it's just... I mean, I think a lot of the percep it's a perception problem with Ron, where most everyday people, and like Alex and David, you won't be happy with me for saying this, but mm. Alex and David do a lot of charity work. They don't talk about it. You wouldn't know half the stuff they mm. do. Whereas all Ron wants to do is come in and talk about his charity work. Perhaps people are a bit angry that he just wants to blow his own trumpet and talk about what he No, does. not at all. I'm just trying to... Make make awareness, OK, of the charity work so that people can contribute and give money like to help Ron, record. Ron the, the other thing I was going to ask is, uh, yeah. this, you say you've got a heart problem. Yeah. Could this be anything to do with the, the amount of drugs that you took back in the world? Because my wife said something about you were snorting Charlie no, in the no, back no, of a, no, a van no. with some <laughs> or something. No. no, that was Charlie. When I was a kid, Charlotte, I think you were... No, listen, I have never intentionally, never, ever... Right, I, I, I was about an 18-year-old in the back of a van. Somebody offered me a cigarette. And Ron was what, stupid enough to what take I it. Wanted, mm. I didn't know what was in it. I didn't know what was in it. You know, and I mean, what you, the But you did say it was me. black. What do you say, black lump or? No, I don't know. What Hello, student. Oh, there's we had someone else. We had mm. someone else there. Um, the the. <clears throat> Let's talk about the The record the ban has been lifted. Uh, Ron's record was actually banned from this show. The boss has heard this phone in and thinks you're incredible and they want to get, the radio station want to get behind your song and play it. They, they want a few things sorted out. They want to know that uh, you don't do drugs. No, you I don't abuse do your... Do drugs, you, no. you don't abuse your body. No. They want to know um, that you are clean living and that the money will go to charity. Exactly. They, they want to help you help other people. Thank Hello, you. studio. Thank you. Hello, oh, yeah, Ron should be changing his name to Nod. Why? Uh, Alex, don't you think Ron should change his name to Nod? Why? Well, it's backwards, isn't it? All right, OK. Hi, who's this? Hello? Whoever that was, they've decided to hang up on you, Ron, and I'm sorry for that. He's dyslexic. Sabrina is dyslexic, by the way. That's why he thinks that Ron, backwards, which, of course, is Nor, is... Uh, what did he say it was? Nod. Nod. Yeah. Mm. He's dyslexic. Right. He's getting mixed up with Don. Perhaps he's your Don Shepherd. <laughs> I don't know, no. Right. OK, look, we have run, we have run right out of time. Um, Ron, I'm, I'm so... Oh, come on. We... Can I just spend Look, one it's minute? it's three minutes past uh, one. The newsreaders right, are standing Ron. by. Ron, when can you come back? Um... I'm not, but I will send you an email. Oh, please, please. Yeah. What are you, you saying? You're never going to come back? 
We're not, we're not in the moment. I mean, I promise I'll come you, back Ron, on there too. Yeah, yeah, of course Ron, I will. I I'll promise come in and see we you need again. to talk to you. I really, really feel we want to talk about these disadvantaged yeah. children. This is what we I want really to talk want about. To talk the Filipino about. This nurses. is what I really want to talk about. You know, because when can you come back? Could you that is and talk about that? Um, give it a couple of weeks, eh? Well, no. Well, why not later in the week? Hmm. Okay. Talk about the Which Philip. Day? Just, um, I promise you, we will not allow any callers. I've got to check my. Can I let you know? Because obviously I've got to check. Don't let diary. us down like you did the hospital, hospital though. If you say you're coming, come. No, yeah, I, mean, right. I haven't let the hospital down. It's just that we're going to play out with Ron singing live. This record will be available soon. Sing along to it. I love my darling. I thank good for your touch. <laughs> A long, lonely time Time goes by so slowly And time can do so much Are you still mine? I need your love. The man is absolutely a fantastic. He's Ron Shepherd, and he will be back soon. Thank you, Ron. You've been fantastic. Thanks, Alex. Thanks, Dave.